It's got such a great cast. What's your funniest or most memorable moment from filming? Watching Dexter and Max, because they're kind of, you know, a junior-senior assassin partnership, which is just hilarious. We shot it in Budapest, and it was a great time to be in Budapest because it was summer, and we were making the most of it, obviously, and every time you do, like, a small indie film and where the crew's so small, everyone really bonds and hangs out all on the weekends, and uh, it was there was a lot of fun weekend parties. We were pretty good on set because we had to get a lot done, but then on the weekends everyone would go to like, have you ever been to the spa parties in Budapest? Going to all the hot pools and stuff like that, it's like kind of a part of their culture, but then at night times turn it into like a, a club essentially and it's just, it's hilarious. It's, um, they're wild. Anyways, and then they've got like these beer bikes where you can ride around the city and there was, oh, what's football event was on at the time as well. Anyways, it was just a great time to be in Budapest. Summer, lots of fun things. So with a big movie like this, there must be some things you shoot which don't make the final cut. I wonder if you remember, like, do you have a favourite deleted scene? Obviously because it's so, like, dialogue heavy, there was, like, and Vaughn's got such a great way with his, with the rhythm of his writing, but obviously a lot of it had to get cut out because, as he would say in his words, it's very wordy. Some movies are like that, where, where everyone just kind of expands on what's on the page and then other ones like this, the, the, the rhythm and the beats were already there on the page, so we kind of stuck to that. Plus there was just so much of it you had to like learn your lines and then you know stick to them. Annie is playful, twisted, got a bit of a bloodlust, a bit like Harley Quinn. Everyone keeps saying that and I just don't, I hadn't thought of that. I see what you mean though but I, uh, I, hadn't, I hadn't seen them as being similar I guess because they exist in such different worlds and times in my life but yes I think they do have a few things in common. I read in an interview that you said that for the Harley Quinn movie you want to see her team up with a gang of girls. Yeah. If you could pick any female comic book character to see her on screen with, who would that be? I have picked a few ones that I want to see on screen with and we're doing it. I've been working on the spin-off film, well the Harley Quinn film for a couple of years now so soon get to show it to everyone, it'll be exciting.